so we're not all alone in the world. There's, there's many of us that are projecting a positive timeline for planet Earth. Yes. And they just want you to concentrate on the fear. Best thing to do is to not observe it, to not feel it, to not be in it. Is actually not observe, just observing and being neutral actually helps not create that reality then? Yes. Hey, my soul tribe. This is Solstice here. So my client was an empath and she wanted to know how to deal with all the terrible things that are going on on this planet right now. And I found it interesting, the response that she got from her higher self on what to do. And I think it would be helpful for you as well. So if you'd like to know how a QHHT session can help you get answers to your questions, just click on the link in the comments below. It will take you to my website at solsticeelliot.com. And let's talk. So her next question is, she's wondering if she should just stop paying attention to what's going on on planet Earth right now to move into a more positive timeline. It really doesn't matter the information that you look at. All depends on the energy that you're radiating from. So if she looks at things in a neutral perspective, they will remain neutral. And does she have a hard time being neutral because she's an empath? She's gotten better with it. It was more so when she was younger. And then she really disconnected with it. And she's getting to a more balanced place. She's able to observe. Obviously, there are still some things that sweep her in and cause an emotional reaction. But this is, of course, a practice. So then it sounds like it's okay for her to keep watching what's happening in the world as long as she stays neutral or can stay neutral. She doesn't observe too much of it. If it's causing too much of an emotional reaction, then of course she shouldn't watch or read any of those things. Well, does she even need to know any of what's going on in the world or does, not even, does it not even matter? She doesn't really need to know. No one really needs to know. You just need to concentrate on your own energy that you are emanating and keep filtering that feeling as when you're in that field you'll only experience what you're already radiating out so even though she might be observing terrible things happening in the world as long as she's in a certain field, she's just only experiencing what she's radiating out. Yes. That's how we start shifting different realities. So is she radiating out a positive timeline right now? Yes. For herself? Yes. So are some people going to be experiencing like a negative timeline? But if she, as long as she keeps radiating this certain field, she'll be experiencing a positive timeline. Is that how it works? Yes. Well, that's really cool. So everyone's just having their own reality then. Exactly. Which is why we can perceive so many different things and still feel like we're living in the same world. Hmm important now to give into the fear mm -hmm. and does she do a pretty good job of not giving into the fear for the most part yes as we said there are certain things that cause an emotional reaction and it's important to be aware of that emotional reaction and then detach yourself from whatever you're observing so is it detaching just kind of being uncaring though about what's going on with other human beings no that's one reality 
but there are so many others. So why keep giving your attention to something that you do not like? So what if we feel like we want to, let me think how to explain this, ask this. So, so if she's radiating in a certain field, then she'll just be guided to do what she feels called to do about what's going on in the world. Is that how it works? Yes, then she'll get that reflection of that reality. And is she doing what she needs to be doing to be helping the planet evolve into a positive timeline? There are many others who are doing the same. So we're not all alone in the world. There's, there's many of us that are projecting a positive timeline for planet Earth. Yes. They just want you to concentrate on the fear. Best thing to do is to not observe it, to not feel it, to not be in it. Uh, is actually not observe just observing and being neutral actually helps not create that reality then? Yes. I see. And those people who need to experience that reality will experience it then. Yes. And as far as she's concerned, she, as far as what she needs to do to help create a positive timeline, that's going to be when she meets this person and starts to work with nature. That's part of her purpose. 